from Paper House. This sliced romance paper pad has 48 lovely papers with foiling and stickers. The pad is 12 inches by 12 inches. It's gummed here at the top to hold that all together. And I've got some of them pulled out so we can look at them. Uh, and it starts with a sheet of 154 cardstock stickers. These are so pretty. First of all, you're getting that large alphabet. You're getting another smaller alphabet with lots of extra letters. You get border pieces and even a little banner. And I love that bicycle. You get extra words. And let me just show you, these are really simple to just peel up. You just peel them up like that, and it's a cardstock sticker. It's not sticker, so it's not thin paper. It's pretty substantial, and you're going to be able to um, stick that wherever you like. It's self-adhesive. We have tiny little uh, banner pieces, a doily piece with this, the heart in the center pops out on that one. So lots of fun elements on here, and this is, I think, perfect for a journaling or for scrapbooking. You can add all of these fun little words and designs as you're going along. So 48 single-sided papers total, and there are 16 different designs. So for each of the ones that I show you here, you will be getting three of them. I'm gonna go through them one at a time here. They are single-sided, but they're nice heavyweight papers. I mean, they're almost cardstock weight, but not quite, but they're still pretty heavyweight. And I really love that the, they are split up into these different panels. So. This is about postcard size. I don't know exactly the size, but the, the, the paper up to that uh, piece here where you cut it off is 12 inches by 12 inches. So this is about six inches by four inches. And these are just beautiful images and you're getting this gorgeous gold foiling on there. So some nice accents, you get words, I love you, you and me, you get these nice lanterns. And with these, you're going to be able to mix and match with the rest of the papers in this set. Nice long panels, which would be great for the front and the inside of a card or a strip across a scrapbooking page. Again, with that beautiful gold foiling. And you're going to get verticals as well. And you can turn some of these sideways if you need to, no problem. This one is a nice vertical because it looks like a chandelier. So lots of beautiful images. They're just so very pretty. I love these smaller sizes too. So these are perfect for cutting out for small planners or little card packs best friends it says up there and this one is in silver so you get gold you get silver and you get lots of little um, sentiments with this and beautiful imagery and then we also have some printed papers within here so the 16 different designs you're going to get three of each of the the items that i'm showing you and i love that split you can use these in small pieces you can cut them up into quadrants and they're really going to mix and match well with the rest of the papers. This is a really beautiful background piece that would be great in its entirety on a scrapbook page. And then more of the pieces that you're going to cut out individually and more uh, combination papers that are going to go well with it coordinating. This one is like a kind of a canvas effect, so it has a real textured look and four of these gorgeous quadrants with some Japanese lanterns and silver chandelier, silver kind of a damask look down here. Very beautiful, and overall tiling that's just completely silver. It's just gorgeous. And teals, and I love the soft color tones in this too. It's really a nice combination of soft colors. So, um, and it's really so pretty. And from this uh, company, Paper House, which just has some beautiful um, paper pads. So I have gone through the entire 16 different designs. So here's the rest of them. Three of each of those gorgeous designs, as well as those really fun and pretty stickers. And that is the Sliced Romance Paper Pad from Paper House.